Good day to everybody. Welcome back to the Formula Sports channel. And as always, thanks for being here. And as always, the support is very much appreciated. Sin. Um, I just want to do this video to say to you know my subscribers, you know, and, and people watching. Let's give Casey Palmer some time. Sin. Um, I've seen the reactions to Casey Palmer's performances for Jamaica, especially after the last one. And to be honest with you, it's kind of to a certain extent fear. You know, to be honest, he has not been playing well for Jamaica since his arrival, even though he hasn't played a lot of games. But, you know, the games that he has played, to be honest with you, I'm look terrible. If I go be, <laughs> if I go be honest and truthful with you know, people, I'm look terrible. More while well, you have wonder if the youth can even control a ball. But now I'm going to lie to you. I remember in the, if memory serves right, it was the Honduras game in the National Stadium. Right? Mr. Casey Palmer controlled a ball. And to be honest with you, man, the ball reached upon the NIM locks. The part where the ball turned upon his neck. Yo. <laughs> I tell you the honest truth, people. And, and to be fair, his control was so bad. His first touch, everything where he did that was so terrible in the game. He was the worst player on the pitch going off memory for, for any team personally. Any team from my standpoint in that game, man. He never really have the excuse of the pitch because even though it wasn't a good performance from everyone, or it wasn't a good for performance from most of our players, at the very least, nobody was as bad or nearly as bad as him. But, you know, even me personally, did a, yo, me did a line up a video for me, Casey Palmer. After the game against Panama, you know, and I said to myself, to be fair, make a game some time. One, he has not played a lot of games for Jamaica. You know, he's kind of, even though he has he made his debut a, a good while ago, he went a long stretch without playing for Jamaica. And relatively, you know, just recently, relatively speaking, got back into the fold. And the, the big reason why I may give him some time, I may give him a little chance, you know, I may go and watch him performance, is because, to be fair, he has been playing out of position. You know, his main position is an attacking midfield role. See, and I don't recall if there's ever been a game, probably one, his debut in that thrashing we got from the United States a couple of years ago. Remember when them did fling the squad together and, and send them go? Remember, sir, it was Austria. We got play that friendly when the, the players, the main players, were on strike, like Bailey and stuff like that. Strike, on strike for pay. If remember, sir, Mert, he played attacking midfield in that game. But apart from that, I don't recall ever seeing a game where he played as an attacking midfielder. Correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section. But yeah, for the most part, he has been played out of out of position, you know, playing in a pivot. And, you know, it's not his main position. So, me, 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 I'm going to be a little bit fear to him and give him some time. And also to be fear, you know, the man are playing at Jamaica's cross is midfield people. People you come in like Jamaica's midfield have a curse. I don't know, any ball away you're flinging at a midfield, eh, them can't really, them can't really do nothing. On a consistent basis, we don't know. Them can really show them quality on a consistent basis. We don't know. We don't know. But I may, may go give him some time. Seeing for those reasons, I'm going to give him some time. I'm not going to lie. I'm not the biggest fan of Casey Palmer. And to be honest with you, more while, even like, especially when he play for Jamaica, I have to really and truly wonder what type of a player he is. Is he? What type of a midfielder is he? You know, because you know you have different types of midfielders. And sometimes, I really have to wonder what type of a player is he? What are his strengths? When he play for Jamaica, you really have to wonder what are his strengths? To be fair, when you watch him at Coventry, I've seen him at Coventry, and it, it does. It, there's a better picture as to what type of a player he is and what are his strengths. You know? I'm still not the biggest fan of him, to be honest with you, even for Coventry, you know, in the games that I've seen with him. 
But I got to give my chance to the national team. The main reason he has mostly been deployed out of position. Who knows? He could basically be a, a square peg being placed in a round hole. See? But may I tell you, if his performance is not improved, my thing is, some of the game them don't just all the, the control, the first touch is so bad. You have to wonder if he's a professional. This, you saw, you saw little glimpses in the first half versus Panama, have some little quality there. But the youth just, him just, he vanished in the second half, and he was a big part of the reason for the midfield collapse and midfield disappearance in the second half versus Panama and why. The defenders every time them get it, them just panic and boot it long because him not show himself and not see him and they just lost. Anyway, make could, could give him a chance and give him some time for second and hopefully we can see him in him rightful position a few times for really judge him fairly. You know? And he'd be waiting the balance. He'd be waiting the balance and hopefully him not, he's not found to be one. You know, knock up the likes button, subscribe and share. Take care, guys. Stay safe and until next time.